there is a specific name that everyone uses for cases that have not been solved for a very long time. Everyone who is suspected of a crime has the statute of limitations. If they cannot be found guilty within a certain time limit, the suspects are free to go. These are called cold case. There are many high-profile cold cases in Korea. In 2015, the statute of limitation was abolished, but cases that have gone cold before demolition are not applicable. Meaning, even if the police have enough evidence now, they cannot charge the suspect for the crime because the limitation is past due. Hwasong serial murder case. He is the worst of all cold cases. 10 women were raped and killed between 1986 to 1991 in Hwasong city. This case has been unsolved for 33 long years. Recently, however, the police pinpointed a man through DNA test. For a while, he was strongly denying the crimes, but with the newfound evidence, he confessed. But unfortunately, the police cannot prosecute him because his statute of limitations has expired. That means this criminal will walk free, unpunished. That is why this is the most infamous cold case in South Korea. This led to a national uproar. Everyone was outraged. He confessed he's guilty, but we can't do anything about it. Unbelievable. Then, should we keep investigating cold cases? Yes, absolutely. If we were to stop investigating cold cases, the criminals would have hope. Crime should not have hope. All criminals and would-be criminals today should know that there is no such thing as a perfect crime. You can run, but you can't hide. Thank you for your time.